What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. Now, first of all, Jaden finally spoke out, girl. She ain't had too much to say. She just told Carlissa to shut the F up. <laughs> I'm kind of excited about that because it's kind of about time. Okay, Carlissa talk about her all the time. Okay, but anyway, Carlissa said um, she ain't called me no liar and she don't know God to love. Girl, shut up. Um, she said ain't nobody around to stop her. She done had it. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> nah, that was funny. Um, y'all, so I had some fried salmon, shrimp, and chicken pasta for lunch. It was so fire what y'all have, okay? <clears throat> um, can't stand moms like this that blame everybody but their son. Now, peep this. It is a recording of what like what Wack said happened. So basically, Wack told the story of what happened. And I don't know if these YouTubers is copywriting and all that. But a guy has a whole recording of it. I'm going to just put that down in the um in the comments. But basically, uh, the situation that happened with the phone, and Wack is calling it a robbery, the robbery of the phone, when Blueface took the phone from old girl because Krishan didn't like the fact that she was recording them or whatever. Um, he took the phone, took the pictures out, gave her the phone back basically, but they called it a robbery because he just snatched her phone. You can't just snatch people's phone. So I don't remember if he was convicted of that, if he went to court for that, whatever. But apparently that has something to do with this charge here. And the fact that he is on a suspended probation, um, that is effect that is affecting that suspended probation. So that violated that suspended probation. How? I don't know. Wax said it. Y'all can listen to it yourself. And for those, the, the, the internet lawyers, let me know. Mm. But um, he said that happened. He said Krishan pulled up. She wasn't supposed to be there. Um, and as soon as she pulled up, she started filming. Um, basically, that's when she went live. She had her tripod. He called it a concoction, girl. She had a tripod um, and was recording. He said, this is her only thing, you know what I'm saying, that that keeps her relevant. Um but basically, she wasn't supposed to be there. Now, the reason why Krishan was there is because Blueface knew about this whole ordeal for a minute. Um, I think it's on Hot Tea Hot Chocolate. But he already knew that this was going to happen. Um, they basically gave him a warning. Not a warning, but let him know what was going on. And basically, he had the choice to turn himself in. So this actually, he already knew about it. That's why his... He has merch out now. <laughs> he has merch out now that says Free Blue Face. He has um, a whole album that is uh, Free Blue Face. Okay? I cannot make this up. Uh, the Voice of Reason has it, but here it goes. It's in my messages. Shout out to my good sis, Kendra. But this is the merch. Uh, um, and, yeah, it's a lot going on with that situation. So he already knew he was going in. Hence is why Krishan already knew he was going in. So Krishan um, was able to come down here and, uh, well, come down here, go to L.A., I guess, to console him, whatever you want to call it. Um, where's my Larry Bapa? <laughs> like, it's 30 degrees outside. And a Larry want to be in the building. It's okay, y'all. We won't be living here next year, baby. I can't wait. So, um, yeah, that's what happened with that whole situation. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that down in the comment section below. And like I said, uh, to the ones that, you know, I already know what's going on. And you, uh, uh, Instagram lawyer, let me know for real what is going on. By the way, hot, tea hot chocolate show that... Um, the court date for this was going to be for today. So he already knew that his court date is today. So he technically wasn't turning himself in. He was going to court, but he he already violated his probation. So hence is why he knew that he might have been going to jail today anyway. So he had the free blue face and all of that. So, um, yeah, that's why that's why we're dealing with that now. We about to go to Carlissa. 
Because Carlissa has some things to say back to Jaden about Jaden telling her to shut the F up, child. It's kind of in the archives. Let me see. <sighs> um, hmm. She promotes her channel throughout, you know, everything. Her Patreon, yeah. She gonna promote her stuff. This is in response to Jaden. Girl, you don't believe, you don't even believe in God. What you could have said was you right. If I love him, I definitely should have popped off in no club, knowing he on probation. When it's your son, you take that advice. Ma'am. Blue face dragged a girl down to the ground at a club. Okay. And it was another incident that I cannot think of right now. But that specific incident, Jaden was the one who was summoned by Blueface. Now, I don't understand why Carlissa doesn't want Blueface to take any uh, accountability at all. It's kind of nasty. Like, it's like, uh, you, you, any certain things just, it's, why everybody else got to take accountability but him? You know what I'm saying? But anyway, so she said that how you hollering for love off God ain't never even been baptized. Now it's for the love of God. Girl, Javon know who the son of God is because I taught him as of last summer. He had no clue. Like I said, take your advice for the love of God. Um, God heard you when you asked for the last laugh. Uh, she says she ain't called me no liar. So who need to shut up? Imagine spending your 27th birthday behind bars. No, 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 no. Imagine spending your 27th birthday and your mama was going to make an OnlyFans for your birthday. Ew. <laughs> that nigga was going to be outside minding his business. And then, boom, he see his mama on OnlyFans. Like, she was literally preparing for that. Carlissa, you got to stop. <laughs> uh... Imagine spending your 27th birthday behind bars for a baby mama that got a girlfriend kissing in front of your kids, hollering to your mama to shut up for the love of God. Oh, okay, this is an oxymoron. Mm -hmm. If you want me to take Junior to see him, Krishan, I will because I know you can't go. <sighs> Y'all, Krishan was at the courthouse. Now, was she in the courthouse? Not really sure. But she was there at the courthouse last jail. Uh, if they didn't take her then, I don't think they have plans to take Krishan. Like, everybody knows what Krishan looks like. If she had a warrant to the point where, and I don't know the, the, the terminology for it, but if she had the warrant to where they wanted to take her to jail, like, hey, yo, can y'all get her? <laughs> We y'all get her so we could uh, bring her back to this damn jail, girl. We've been looking for her for three years. You know what I'm saying? None of that is happening here with Krishan. Her ass ain't got locked up yet. She's, I mean, she tells you where her her uh, performance dates are, all kind of shit. I'm not understanding. I'm not understanding. But anyway, so that is that. Y'all, let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I think Carlos is dead ass wrong. Um, you know. It's all right to be upset, but uh, Blueface probably done, ever since he been on probation, done at least punched at least 17 people in the face. You know what I'm saying? Dragged the girl in the club. Um, punch, beat up Krishan and uh, Jaden, okay? Ain't no telling what other women he done beat up and, you know, what other men he done beat up. All right, so y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comment section below. I'm absolutely done with this video. Please to the internet lawyers. Tell me what's going on. I may not have the right verbiage, but I have the lineup correct. All right. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Yeah, yeah.